Imagine walking down the street or having a conversation or watching television. Located in Bastion Square, in the heart And the sounds fade in and out. You can't make out the words. All you hear is a drone or mumbling. Only 10% of the total. My hearing definitely is lost. I used to be able to hear anything. Millions of Canadians are affected by hearing loss. And with an aging population, you can expect millions more to be affected in the coming years. But with the stigma of losing your hearing, many don't bother getting tested. In fact, it takes the average person about seven years to take action. There's studies that show that you start to... Um, sort of avoid the social communication or contact so you know you start to get feel isolated and that of course will lead to you know possibly to depression so it's more common than you think that hearing loss can lead to a poor quality of life when family members become impatient or you don't think you have a problem hearing loss can leave you socially isolated but it's not just an issue with seniors it's also affecting people aged 30 to 40 that could be due to today's lifestyle yeah, with iPods and MP3 players, all of that, people are definitely um, very aware of the importance of hearing. So yes, we do get a, a wide range of ages coming through and asking for hearing testing. 58-year-old Rose McDonald used to enjoy concerts and restaurants, but now she shies away from them because the background noise is too much. So she came here to connect hearing to get her first hearing test. I'd rather do some preventative measures than wait until I've really bad and then find out that I could have prevented something. Mm -hmm. There are about 250,000 hearing aids sold in Canada every year, but unlike years past, when you had to wear these big bulky ones that, let's just say, they're not that nice to look at, nowadays you can get the smaller, sleeker ones that are hardly noticeable. The computerized allows us to eliminate some of the common problems we have with hearing aids like whistling, um, you know, poor sound quality. All of those things are pretty much the thing of the past. McDonald doesn't need this right now, but when she does, she says she wouldn't hesitate to put one on. If you really think about it, having to wear something in your ear to make you hear better, it's better to do that than to not be able to hear at all. Hearing aids don't come cheap, but they do come in all shapes and sizes. And while they aren't covered under your medical services plan, Connect Hearing, like other clinics, offer financial options. Audiologists say you just can't afford to ignore your hearing. They recommend after you hit 40, you should have a test annually. In Victoria, I'm Sucheta Singh, your health and wellness specialist.